I got stepbrothers, stepsisters, and I'm only, I'm only close with one of my stepbrothers, which is Jeremy. We real close because we kind of was in the same house, you know, had them weird games, you know, I fart in his face while he sleep, you know. <laughs> nice brother games. So, you know, so, you know, I, but it was cool because I was always the youngest and I had no brother. So when I actually had a brother, it was cool because I had somebody to look up to, you know, he had the swag. You know, not now. I don't know what his swag is now. But when we was in school, he had the swag out the world, you know, had the girls. I wanted to be like him. I wanted to be like him until I took him to the hospital. This is when I didn't want to be like him. I didn't know he had a phobia, a needle phobia. If anybody y'all know my brother, yes, a lot of tattoos. Can't do a shot. I don't understand that pattern. That's never he didn't see. So I took him. He was having, I don't know what was wrong with him. He just wasn't feeling good. I don't know if he had eggs on the booty and hemorrhoids popping there. I don't know. I took him to the hospital. And I was the only one there. So he was just tripping. He started coming back, you know what I'm saying? And they had said he was throwing up too much. He needs some, you know, IV. I've never seen my brother do this. But they pulled, he, the doctor over there, he just working with the needle. My brother talked to me. He looked at me. He said, ah. I said, Jeremy, what's wrong with you? No. Don't let her do it, please. Don't let her do it, please. They grabbed his arm. Ah! Now, after that, I still love my brother, but I don't too much look up to him after that. That's just, 